Welcome back to Will It Shoe, your favourite show where we make shoes. We use scraps, waste materials, offcuts, things that people have sent in and things that we've tried to divert from landfill to see if they'd be any good for making shoes. We've got an amazing team of skilled craftspeople in the factory just behind me, so if you hear a load of knocking and banging, that's what that is. Um, and yeah, sorry we've not been here for a while. It's probably been a good, a good hot minute since we uh, last put one of these out, but we have a massive bunch of new materials to work through. Some of the team are on board and we're gonna make it happen. And yes, we might have done this material before, but not quite like this. We have a lovely big box of offcuts from our friends at Hyatt Denim. Founded by entrepreneurs Claire and David Hyatt back in the day, uh, the goal was to bring manufacturing back to a Welsh town which had previously had quite a massive manufacturing history for jeans and then didn't, as is the way of most things with uh, small, small manufacturers in this country. Um, but I believe the town was about 4,000 people and around 400 of those were employed making jeans. So pretty big part of the local economy and a sad one to lose. Um, so obviously Claire and David endeavoring to bring that back and I think we can all say they've done a pretty grand job of that, um, working through direct customer and with the advent of the internet helping to push that. Um, something very close to our own hearts as a manufacturer that sells shoes, direct customers. I uh, feel like it's going to be a really good collab. Famously part of the No Wash Club, uh, adored by jeans lovers all around the world. You know, the idea that washing your jeans just takes away the character, fades the indigo and all that. Um, I don't know what relevance that has to shoes, but I wanted to get that in there. Denim has worked for us before. Um, it's a really good stretchy material. I hope it doesn't look stretchy, but there is good stretch in there. Um, it's a strong fabric, hence why it's traditionally been used for workwear and things like that as well. So that should stand up to the rigors of the lasting process. It should be fairly pleasant for the team to work through. You know, let's start them off with something easy and simple and see how we go from there. Can only get a lot more difficult with some of the uh, crap we've got lined up. Right, time to send these off to the factory and wait and see what comes back. Thank you. 
I'm into those straight away. Okay, first things first. Yes, we have done denim before, but these straight away are the best Janas we've done yet. Absolutely loving the contrast piece choices. So we've got this like brown denim on this side, the ecru for the heel detail, and then obviously the indigo for the sort of outside main upper. They just look so good. What's really surprising about these is how finished they look, considering that this started from a bag full of scraps. Like it was genuinely just little off cuts, little scraps, and they have made something really premium looking. I am always so impressed by the skill in the workshop. They are yet to really turn down a challenge, but sometimes they just knock something out that just looks so believably real as a shoe that should exist. And this is one of those. Considering denim became so popular and synonymous with workwear because of how hard wearing and long lasting it was, I really have a lot of faith in the durability of these. I think they would stay looking sharp for a long time as well. I also think they would age in a really unique way. You know, leather patinas, it looks amazing after a few years, but denim also patinas. I'd love to see some of those crazy denim heads that roll around in the sand and rub stones on their jeans to get a very specific fade, have a go at these, see what they can do. If you are one of those denim heads that gets obsessed over fades and uh, the no wash club and all that, then uh, let us know what you think in the comments. If you're not a denim head, let us know what you think as well. We care about your opinion too. Now we are gonna send these back to Hyatt and it'd be really interesting to see what they think about them. But for now, all I really care about is what do you think about them? They have obviously shooed very successfully. Is this a production run? Is this one that actually makes it into production? Would you buy Hyatt scrap Janas? Do let me know in the comments. I would genuinely love to know. And you know, like, we do listen. Like, if you want to see things made into shoes, we we, we do listen. Uh, if you have any other ideas for things that we should try on here, something that you might genuinely wear, then definitely comment that. And until next time, see you then.